Wow. Into the Italy half, taken on by O'Toole. O'Toole sees a bit of space. The offload to Carpenter. Oh, but Carpenter couldn't find Fairhurst, who was alongside him. Vossawai comes away. Ryden. O'Toole again showing his speed. But just unable to find McKenzie coming down the inside. But Chauncey O'Toole showing his speed again. Can they produce it here, the Italians? Well, it's slow ball, and Canada have defended well. And they've turned it. Fairhurst. That's one maybe for Hearn to chase. Back goes Bacchetti. Also the fullback Trevisan. Across comes Trainer. And the fullback tries to run it and he loses it. And here's another chance for Marshall. In exactly the same corner. Marshall getting driven towards the try line. Now can they produce it? Fairhurst. Hearn. Oh, and Hearn has spilt it. But the referee's blown his whistle. He's going to his pocket as well, is Dave Pearson. And he's shown the yellow card. Cynical play. The referee saying cynical play, and off goes the captain, Barrio Bernabo. And you've got an argument there, cynical play, which took the ball away from the Canadian. Could that be a penalty try decision as well? Because it's right in the on the try line. The ball is coming out to the Canadian player. If Pearson thinks that that has stopped the try, he should be under the post there, I think. And also Tyrone, I guess after a relatively stodgy first 40, you have to admire a bit of ambition, but what on earth were the Italian back three doing there? Well, we were complaining about not seeing any action in the 22s. It's just been one 22 to, to the other. All the time. Vasamai could have easily got that ball away if he just kept hold of it. Touch. Pause. And instead, and they having a scrummage for their lives here. Get it in. Well, their best attacking set piece of the match so far. Picked up by Carpenter. Carpenter driving over the line. Has he got there? Time His up. teammates are Fair claiming it. Monroe. There's Sinclair, the man who was stitched up in the first half. I mean that literally, having picked that cut up on the uh, top of his head. Taken into the contact there by Ericsson. He was one of the veterans of that win against France A last season. That was Trainer and through goes McKenzie. McKenzie offloading to Hobson. Pritchard's in the line. Right in front of the post. Fairhurst out of the back of the hand. Gathered by Smith. And Canada looking dangerous here. Driven on again. Fairhurst. The change of direction. Ryden, the captain. The Italy defence really being tested. Biden's the loose head prop. Nine, move. There are four men out to the left here. And through goes Carpenter. Hands off. But the referee in the perfect position. They've still got possession. McKenzie. Can he offload it? Less than a metre to go here for Canada. There's Marshall. Right on the line, Stebano's there, but Marshall thinks he's grounded it on the line. So Bocchino with the restart. Carpenter that time, another gust felt around Franklin's Gardens. So tall again, working up ahead of steam. Van Sale eventually let go of him. O'Toole has made some valuable, valuable meters today. Monroe, Smith, Trainer. Pritchard having to reach back there for that ball with his right arm. He did well, did the fullback. There's Fairhurst to Monroe. Canada playing with real purpose here. Ericsson, Hearn. O'Toole finding himself on the wing up against Bacchetti. Hearn looping around, that foot just staying in play. Monroe, he's got Sinclair looking for the ball, but it was, well, widely telegraphed. And the ball's been turned over. At the moment, Italy producing very little. Canada will be mindful to keep the error count down. There's O'Toole again seeing a bit of space. He's got Pritchard tracking. There's Pritchard. Pritchard straight under the post. Quite superb. And once again, created by that man, Chauncey O'Toole. What a match he's having. Absolutely superb. But 
They did all the hard work in the middle of the pitch. They're running onto the ball and they exposed the Italian. The narrowness of the defence got outside Pratichetti and Shotzi O'Toole. Well, he's been everywhere. What a line from Pritchard. Tracked O'Toole, hit the perfect line, split the defence, and it has been one way traffic. Apart from that lift off the back of the scrum from Basavo, one way traffic from Canada, and that is high quality rugby.